Hello there, Mr. Gretzky9966 here with just a comic book haul from last week. Stuff that came in that I finally picked up last week and everything. So this is Hulk 146 from 1971. Picked this beauty up, 6.0. Got this off eBay. Most all these are probably pretty much eBay pickups here and everything. So got this beauty CGC 6.0. Then I got this um, one here 345. They think this is the first Doctor Death. Appearance, if I'm not mistaken. It's appearance of Dr. Death. Or Dr. Death appearance, I don't remember right offhand what I got it for. What it said it was. But, oh yeah, here's Action Comics. Um, I got this from the store the Friday. This is uh, 472. This clink... Helps me get everything, I think, from 440 all the way to the end, if I'm not mistaken. So, 440 to the end, I need 11 more to have, four, 11 or 12 more to have 400 to the end of Action Comics. Then, however many more, 100 and something more, a little over 100 and something, I think it's under 110 I need to complete the rest after I get those. I think it's like a hundred, it might even be a hundred left after I get those 11 or 12. And I'll have everything from 260 to the end. So hopefully, if I can get lucky next year at a couple of conventions, find a couple of the books that I need, and then I'm going to go to um, the con in um, Raleigh. Ultimate Comics puts it on, it's called the Bull City Con. It's the Raleigh Comic Con that they renamed the the uh, Oak City Con. They run the Bull City Con, which is in Durham, North Carolina, which is actually the Durham, uh, the NC Comic Con that they renamed the Bull Con. Or the NC Comic Con, Bull Durham, or the Bull City Con, whatever the nickname is, they know, however they say it now. But yeah, those are the two, but I'm only probably going to go to the one and then there's a couple of mini cons we have with um, in Wake Forest. There, a guy there um, runs a shop in Wake Forest, in downtown Wake Forest, down there at the cotton at the cotton um, mill. He runs a couple of things, so we're hoping that we can do that and everything next year so hopefully the, whenever that happens I'll go to that but I'll go to the one con that free comic book day at Ultimate Comics and carry I'll probably hit that one I'll probably hit that for what it's worth so probably those four those three are probably the main three I'll probably hit next year and I might I'm not sure yet but I might go to the Greensboro one or depending on who's coming to Durham next year, I might go to Durham. But I'm skipping the Raleigh Supercon this year. I don't really want to go there. And then I might hit the shop in Archdale, North Carolina up there. So we might. So basically, we might take two trips up there to do them. A couple of trips. Two trips there. Um, the con. The Raleigh. The word con in Raleigh. The trip out to Archdale. Two times to Archdale, the mini con and free comic book day might be the main stuff I do next year to find books. So hopefully I can find some more action comics, but this is what I got so far. And then this, I picked this up at the store. It's the Halloween Spectacular Archie book. They had this at the store too, so I grabbed it. Just love that cover. Bride of Frankenstein. And then Archie and them as mummies. 
a pumpkin jug head and some other stuff. So that's really cool. Then I got this off of eBay. This is a real great deal I got off of a guy. He was selling a bunch of these things. So that's um, a 10 cent Batman from number 140. So that's one of the 10 center Batmans from back in the day. The bad guy's running around on a boat. I think that's bad. It looks like Batwoman there. The eighth wonder of space. And then we got this one here. I don't know why I didn't have this one. 361. This was the um, first appearance. If I'm not mistaken, this is the first appearance of Harvey Bullock. Here with Man Bat in it and everything. So I need to change that bag out. I think that's a little better there. But yeah, that's the first appearance of Man Bat of Harvey Bullock. Detective Harvey Bullock. Let me get this out of here. Hang on a minute. I got it. Here's the um, other book I got with the um, the Menace of the Multiply Creature. Batman and Robin battle the menace of the multiply creature. This is uh, a giant crab. Or lobster. Giant lobster. Then Detective Comics 288. Saw this and this was a great deal also. On there. Great book. Not, not a very, not a bad book at all. So that helps get some more detectives. I mean, I'm not really collecting all the way down to 288, but to have some of those books, some more Silver Age stuff is a lot better than that. I think I'm collecting. I'm collecting 391 to the end, and then I've got three, 259, 252. I don't remember. I think it's 259, I think. I think it's 259, the first appearance of Calendar Man, I want to try to get. And then the first appearance of Polka Dot Man, Mr. Polka Dot, is in, 390, is in 300 of Detectives. So I both want to get both of those, hopefully try to get both of those next year and everything. I almost had a, a, a Mr. Polka Dot this year, but guy didn't want to budge too much on the price so i didn't really pursue it i probably could have probably could have took it for what he offered it was still a pretty good deal but it wasn't what i was looking to pay for it so i moved on so hopefully i can find another one pretty cheap next year and then this so basically it's like 20 it's like 259 288 to 300 then 306 through 309 then 350 I think I have 356 3 354 356 and 357 I think something like that and then another book other than that another one after that then probably 391 all the way or 390 to the end or 391 to the end just depends on what I want to do but yeah I know there's some other people out there that are collecting like Hippie said he was collecting Detective 400 to the end but you know I've got probably a long box full of Detective now and then probably another long box of Detective probably going to be started next year and then hopefully might have a third long box started a detective so you never know i might stop some series along the way that i know i'm not going to be able to complete right now and i might just stop it because the books get too pricey or the books are just not where i want them to be and like ams i might stop that at some point buying those and just see what i need and get the cheaper ones i can get and then the ones that are more expensive down the road let them go because I'm trying to get everything from 55. I'm trying to get everything from 55 to the end with a couple of reprints in there if I have to. 
of a couple of the books and and that so that'll do me then I got these Archie books from another from the same collector I think I got the um uh, the Batman 140 from I got these Archie books from him the two per I have to check but yeah I got the Archie 180 I got the Archie 157 just look at those nice covers. I got the Archie. One sixty two. I got the Archie one fifty three. I think that's all that's in there. One. Just those two. Yeah, just those two books. And then I got this Action Comics here. This is the son of the... And... Uh, Hiller Tor. I don't know how you pronounce that, how you say that. But yeah. It's basically the guy... The kid with the fist, the super fist. I guess he's busting stuff down. I guess this is the guy that got arrested for some reason. Oh, he hit the... It looks like he took down the Washington Monument is what it looks like. But yeah, this is 356... And another 12 center, another one off the list here. So that's just what I got so far, people, for this week. Also got a couple of books from that are done by Steve, Bo Steve Bowie. Um, he was doing Linda 7000. I'm going to do a separate video on those once I get them read. It's, I got issues one and two, so I'm going to read those and, and get my thoughts on that so alrighty i'll talk to you guys later bye